I mean, I think definitely if I just like limit it to sports, Brittany Griner's detainment and her, her release to me would easily be in the top three and it's and it's not three, you know, because I don't think anybody had on the bingo card an American athlete would be wrongfully detained in Russia, held captive for as long as she is, and then released in the same year. Because I, I think, understandably so, for a lot of people, that looked like a very dismal situation. And we didn't know how long um, Brittany was going to be detained if she would have wound up having to do this full nine-year sentence she was originally uh, mm-hmm. given to see her railroaded it that way. And then what I think is kind of worse is that the fact that there was an overwhelming joy about her return was just really disheartening. Not even for say. an hour. Not even for an right. hour. Yeah. I mean, it was a, that was just really disheartening because anytime you can get an American out of a Russian prison, it should, it should be celebrated. And so 